Third time in the last 366 days, cold water in Columbus. Bishop Hartley meeting on the gridiron. Cavs won both matchups last year, including that state title game, when quarterback Brody Hoyne rushed for three touchdowns and had a key interception on the defensive side of the ball, prompting the Hawks head coach Brad Birchfield to jokingly request that Hoyne skip his senior year of football to run cross country. While well, the Eastern Michigan recruit did plenty of running last week, topping 200 yards on the ground in the win over Kenton, while well, the Hawks were on the road and lost to a perennial small school power in Michigan, Muskegon Catholic Central. This one would be living up to the hype. Band getting ready in this one. First quarter, no score. Brody Hoyne airs it out to Aaron Harlemert. Big game there. Same drive, Brody does what he does so well, takes it down and runs for the 27 yard score. Cavs up seven to nothing. Hawks trying to answer, facing a fourth down in Cavalier territory. Jake Ruby nowhere to go, Colin Seitz makes the tackle for loss. Coldwater gets it back, but Brody Hoyne, a leg injury, left the game. So Jack Hemmelgarn in a quarterback. He airs it out to the near side, right in stride with Craig Shanehair all the way down to the 12 before he is run out of bounds. Hemmelgarn now looking left. See how he does as the quarterback looks left, comes back to the right and finds Derek Toby in the end zone. Coldwater up 14 to nothing. Final seconds of the first quarter. Hartley trying to answer back before the lightning. Ryan Anderson's got some speed to the outside. A 90-yard touchdown cuts that Coldwater lead in half. 14-7, the halftime score. This one just got suspended about 10 minutes ago. Saturday at 1 o'clock, they will resume action.